In this video, we'll go over the initial setup of your DVR to get it ready for your app. On the CCTV camera systems, your cameras connect using a BNC Balin connector. They slide over. Once they're in, it rotates and locks in place. These DVRs do not have Wi-Fi on them, so they do require a hardline plug-in cord. So you'll need to plug in an Ethernet cord into the DVR and then plug in your Ethernet cord into your router. That will give the DVR internet. On the front of the DVR, there will be a TXRX light lit. With a mouse connected to the DVR, you'll be able to move around. On the GNS DVR, you will right click the mouse, click the home menu, go to system, network, TCP IP needs to have the enable DHCB box checked. If it is not checked, go ahead and check the box to enable DHCP. This will allow your DVR to connect to any router that is connected to. Click apply if you've made any changes and it will put an IP address in grayed out numbers here for you. Once you have done that, you'll click advanced on the left, click on platform access on the top, and then you'll need to enable platform access. Click the enable box. It will ask you to agree to the service terms. If it's the first time that you've done this, it will also ask you to allow access for your mobile phone to scan. Click the checkbox here. Click OK. You can view your verification code here. You will need that during the bind operation. From here, you'll click Apply on the bottom. Once it applies, you'll notice the status is online. With the status online, your DVR is now set up for you to add to the Guarding Vision app. Thank you for watching.